Happy Mother's Day. We're going to church and the sky is blue. No more rain. Emily and Dylan. Yeah. It's supposed to be nice. It rained earlier. Yeah, it rained earlier. Emily and Dylan went with my mom and dad ahead of us to church because it gets packed. And Malia and Colby's with us. We like eating at Famous Saves because we went to church later. So we're not doing the usual brunch. Mother's Day, Mom. See, O'Brien's mom said Happy Mother's Day. Yes, Happy Mother's Day, Mom. Is it a bunk and a baby or seven and a baby? Did you make this one call? Huh? You were holding it the whole time in church? Did you give it to me? Did you paint them? How did you make it colorful? You don't know. What's the matter? Wow. Daddy! Daddy! A straw! Yeah. And there's there's not really there's not a lot of definite ones you can get, but I don't think it shows. You do, but we oh, you didn't break it. I'm very neat. So I'm gonna pop this open. Oh, let me try. Uh, okay, I got it. I hope yeah, I got it. You gotta put okay, so gave me all of their Mother's Day stuff. But I just Last wanted to one. show. Hold on, Dylan. I want to show wait, wait. like my favorite part of each of your sets of gifts. So this was from Emmeline. And she wrote me this whole story about us. And then this is the funniest part. The best thing about you, Mom, is you are a YouTuber and a mom. She do the YouTube sign there. And then all of us. So cute. And then what about, what's the other thing? This is from Dylan. One of the things from Dylan, and it made me cry. This part where it says, um, Every day I'm growing, I'll grow. I'll be growing someday, and those tiny handprints will surely fade away. Oh, and look at his little handwriting. And then Malia's. This is my favorite part about what she gave me. She made me this card. And then look how cute this is. Look, did you see the hawk? I did. I loved it. It's a sun hawk. I love everything. And look, I love you because. Isn't that cute? They all did cute stuff. Even Emmeline did this thing in school. There's so many things. You showed my ring? Oh, yeah. I'm wearing your ring. Hold on. Look how cute this is. Got it for you. Blowing you kisses. Got it, Mom. And hold on, Malia gave me this ring. And yep, bling bling. And it came inside this thing. So she picked it and put it inside this little Open container. Open it! What is it now? And you gave me something else, right? You gave me a, fla a plant? Yeah, everything. What is this? It's a card. It says, what's this? Oh, each, happy Mother's Day. Each you wrote that yourself? Yeah. Mother's Day. What else does it say? D. Something <laughs> Dylan. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day. Dear you got the H right. Mom. Oh, he, from re Dil he really tried to write it. From Dylan. Show it to Daddy. Babe, look what he did. He, babe, he knows the first sounds of all the letters. He said it says, Happy Mother's Day, dear Mom. From Dylan. I did all my stuff. Here eating Rita's Icy's. And I got go. ice cream. No, Soft no, ice cream. No, no. We tried to go an to another Rita's that was by us, but that just we thought it opened. But when we got there, when we got there, it says open on Wednesday, the 11th. <laughs> We have to drive over here. Oh yeah, that pharmacy over there. Yeah. Girls, sit down right now. Sit down. No, no, no. Sit down. Eat. Okay, we're just leaving Target. Mom 
Mother's Day is complete without going to Target. Needed more allergy medicine, eye drops, everybody's allergies is acting up today. Not me. Oh no, not Malia, not me and Mia, only Daddy, Emmeline, and Dylan. Good morning, happy Monday. I'm headed to work out. Did not do these classes last week because they were canceled, but I did work out from home doing 25 once at least. So, yeah. Hope you all had a great Mother's Day. Um, it was a nice, relaxing day for me yesterday. Of course, I love to spend it with them. Um, versus, like, doing something alone. Which would also be peaceful, but, you know, it's nice because the kids were so excited to give me... I don't think I vlogged it, but they were so excited to give me all their gifts that they made me. And cards and made me tear up. Those are my favorite kinds of gifts. And of course spending time together was nice. So yeah, headed to work out. Dylan is sick. He had a fever last night so I kept him home and he has bad allergies on top of that. So yeah, and then we got to do some groceries later. So it's going to be a really, really busy week. I have a few events lined up but I don't think I can go to all of them. Especially with Dylan now being sick, so I'm just gonna play it by ear and do the best we can and then um, Brian has blood work to do for his follow-up from the oncologist and his his um, CAT scans are scheduled for next month so so that it will be six months from his last one because the doctor doesn't want him to do it every three months because it's just I guess it's just a lot of exposure to the radiation and all that. So yeah, here to work out. Sorry, shopping. Wait to sleep. Wednesday. I like your hair. Okay, let's go. Happy Wednesday. I just dropped off Dylan after he was home for two days. But um I'm going to pick up the girls now, drop them off at school, and what's on the agenda? I need to work out <laughs> at some point today. So I have my second workout of the week. And then um Brian has blood work that we've been putting off since Monday because Dylan was home. And I think we might get the brakes fixed today, so we'll see. But um, I didn't vlog at all yesterday. I thought I did, but I snapped, of course. But I didn't vlog, but not much happened. I just um, had to work late with the kids. I actually was there till nine. Um, this is the girl that usually comes in to cover me after the girls are, or the, the kids are done with classes and dance um, is on vacation, so, um, what do you call this? Uh, maybe I might insert, I might have inserted this clip of Dylan doing some, um, trying to do some break dancing moves when he was, you know, watching the boys hip hop class. They're like older kids, so funny, but um, yeah, that'll be Dylan's class one day. Good morning. Where's Mia? Oh, you closed the door on her. Hi, what's the matter? There's a really smack bat on me. What? Who's three months old today? He just took her picture. Look at the big girl now. Look at her pretty shirt. Yeah. Six to nine months clothes. Oh, look at you so pretty. You're so pretty like the kitten. Pretty bubbles. Happy three months. You want to see yourself? Who's that pretty girl? Hey. Hey. You talking to yourself? 
Hi. Hi. So busy watching TV. I'm in the hospital because Brian's getting his blood work. She's being a good girl. TV was there just for you, Colby. Having a late breakfast date. What time is it? 11.36. Brunch. With our sleeping beauty there. Oh, craving pancakes. That looks good. Oh, I just did my first run in 11 months. It's so nice outside, but Colby went to sleep and Brian was cooking, so it's like instead of doing T25, I went to run. I did only like a mile and a half, but I feel like it's good considering I just started again. So my pace is really slow, but I did it and I'm gonna take a shower because I stink. I stink. In Costco, I'm sorry, I might do a haul out of the trunk again later. And we have Colby with us. She needed diapers. And now she's size three. We're trying size three. Yeah, that's it. This one? Uh, we made it like three minutes late into the show to watch Tuck Everlasting. Tuck, hi. Hi. So it's, fun, um, I like the movie it's, a lot. um, intermission right now. Yeah. Yeah. You I like it so you, far? I will I tell you something. Would you live forever? Yes. yes. <laughs> what is the real age of the Tuck family? Ooh. Like real, real life, life the actors? <laughs> <laughs> What's the real age of each actor? I'm 53. <gasps> what? Oh, okay. I'm actually four, I'm 47. Uh, uh, no, Miles is... We're not, we're not going to give away the season. <laughs> we just came from the musical and Emily wanted to say after to watch the um to watch to get more autographs but we had to go because Coley was crying. At least got, and now we're uh, here. Uh what's his name? What? Uh this one's open stage? Jesse. Jesse's uh thing. Autograph, Andrew. yeah. Andrew. There's Tito Mike. And we're gonna go eat here. It's Vietnamese. What? Are you serious? The Vietnamese place was closed. Or closing. So we're gonna just drive over the next block to Wonton Garden. There's Colby with Nino Mike. Nino Mike. We're eating now at Wonton Garden. 
water I am headed sorry I'm headed to go um, to my workout at across the floor my third workout this week finally back on track um, I didn't do cheat 25 on Wednesday I went running and that was really good I felt so good from that it was sore but you know I'll get stronger I think it's you know a matter of changing it up time to time so and slowly get there but anyways um, I didn't really get to vlog yesterday before or after um, the musical because we were in so much traffic on the way we left even we even left at 4 30 and the show started at 7 and we were still late but only by three minutes which was really lucky the show was long as all Broadway shows are but I think Dylan could have sat through it but they said eight years and up and Malia is old enough because even though she's not eight, um, they've seen, you know, tons of like musicals and stuff before off Broadway, but um, their broad, the last Broadway, their first Broadway show, actual Broadway show was Cinderella and they were much younger. So yeah, I was saying on Snapchat this morning, there's no way like our family could afford to all of us to go to Broadway shows. Or even a Broadway show it would be way way over $500 for all of us um, depending on the seats so anytime we get an opportunity to go to a Broadway show or any show for that matter I do my best to take advantage of it because I just want to expose them to that I didn't have a chance to see Broadway until I was I think I was in college or maybe high school when I saw Miss Saigon for the first time and then I went to see that again with Brian and when I was in college at Rutgers, I took a musical theater course and we got super cheap tickets to see shows. So I took advantage of that at the time, saw Rent when it was still on Broadway and so many other ones. I've kept all the playbills. It's just that now having kids, it's not as easy to go like when we were dating. So I'm just grateful that you know we do get you know opportunities to see shows in general so seeing another Broadway show with the girls was such a treat and you know I really enjoyed it and I know that they enjoyed it too especially Emily. And they randomly saw Evelyn's tap teacher we always run into across the fam across the family across the floor family out and about and totally random so the city is not as big as we think you know of all the places and all the times to run into somebody they ran into Evelyn's tap teacher there in Times Square. I'm trying to cook quick before she wakes up doing spaghetti with meat sauce and tacos because I want to make use of the beef that I defrosted. I want to pick up the kids and I have less than 30 minutes. Snap this but I know not everybody watches my Snapchat, but I finished cooking in like under 30 minutes. The meat sauce, spaghetti, the taco meat, the tacos, um, the fixins, I put the cheese. I packed up um, strawberries and blueberries, spaghetti for the girls for dance, and some snacks. I even did the dishes and I had to change the garbage, add new garbage. And I did it. All in under 30 minutes, and she's still sleeping. So we just came from watching Angry Birds. We were late again, so I couldn't vlog before. But this one, she was watching the whole movie, right? She was so good. He was so good. And then now we're supposed to go to the zoo. They're having like an event at the zoo, and there's a shuttle, but because we have the stroller and all that, I think we're, we're just gonna drive over there. Come on. What's enough water? Come on. Is there an elevator there? Yeah. Come on. You want to go or not? Angry Birds movie. So that's what we saw. Angry Birds. Now we're going to go to the elevator. Did you park far? So everybody else is taking the shuttle over there. But we're just going to take the car so we don't have to worry about a way back. The only thing is, babe, 
If we took the shuttle, we would have had to find another way back. Oh. How much would that have cost? And they're giving a $50 thing. Is that enough? Like, we wouldn't even fit in, like, a taxi. Oh, you gotta take a train. Yeah, see? So we're better off driving. I so, it's such a nice day. It's supposed to rain later. So, oh, is that our car right there? Oh, you parked so near. Yeah, Guys, don't go yet. Hamelin, that's a lot of uh, popcorn. Hey, we're here at the Bronx Zoo. Okay, we're still waiting. Everybody else is still on the bus. Flamingos. A dock over there. There's ducks too. Watch your eyes. There's a peacock. Other side. Just you know hanging what? out there. Kobe, it's your first time at the zoo, Kobe. Your first time at the zoo. Bubbles? Dylan wants to. Oh, this is what they have. They have different salads. Malia, go ahead, get one. Just get a different one then. Wrap sandwiches. Mommy Bloggers lunch menu. They're eating now. Are you eating, Emmalyn? You want a different kind of sandwich? Just go get it. Thank you, Malia. Give me. What's his name? The bird? What's his name? Huh? Redbird? You want to go over there and say hi? Where's Emmalyn? Where's Emmalyn? Emmalyn, come here. Go take a picture. Say hi. <laughs> You gotta pose for a picture. Colby, you missed it. You missed it. Let's finish eating. You want the cool glasses? My eyebrows are big. My two eyes turning into a book. We're walking to this way, Emmalyn. We're going to see a bird show. Want me to take her out? I'm going to show you some little specialty that she's learned. See, in the wild, these guys are on the horse, so they, that just means they eat a little bit of everything. Right? Maybe some bugs, some fruits, and some insects. Well, today we've got a little piece of grape here. That's no harm done. That was a special, a special flyby there, Eeyore. You did a great job. Again, this is Eeyore, our silvery cheeks horn bill from Africa. Especially when they're flying, circling up on you, you'll see that red tail right through the sky, right through the sunlight. Five crowns of us because she, she actually was a Texas bird. She came to us from Texas and she was injured when she was flying out of the wild. She was hit by a car. You might feel something over your head. I should warn you folks here if you duck lower, he just flies even lower. Wow. We'll just do a few flights back and forth here and let you folks get a close look at her. And just watch when he flies. He, yeah. he flies to save energy by going lower. Cool. Like I said, if you duck, you just see. You like the bird show? Do you like the bird show? Huh? Huh? And Dylan over there sitting with CJ. And we're going to show you how you can help. Where is he? Oh, right there on CJ's lap. Where's the girls? Oh, I missed it. They were all over her. That was funny. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh oh. Whoa. And they're all over her. Like you look around. Okay. You, yeah. Cute. Oh my gosh. Cute. So nice. Dylan. Don't do that, guys. Female. 
look who woke up. Did you see the reptiles? Does it say that? Blue Tree Monitor. Oh, it's like a little snake. It's like a baby. What is that? What is it? It's on top. Blue Tree Monitor. Oh, protecting the baby. Not amused. Colby is not amused. Gross. My least favorite. My least favorite exhibit. Ugh. You like it, Mia? Uh, yeah? Mm. You like it, Colby? And. Oh. She said no. What's over here? Oh my god. Super moms. They're super moms. they're trying to get busy. Look. Brian said those two are trying to get busy. <laughs> this was other one and she was like, yo. Yo. What's this now? Okay. So they're sitting with his there. back against the rock. Yeah, there's a right? There, yeah. I can't see that one. Oh, and that other there's one over there. Oh, I can't see. It's too like short. He went up there. Because you guys are so noisy. He's like, I'm getting out of here. Now you see him moving. Cool. He's too smart. Oh my god, you're so. Polar bear, but there's no ice. Eat. Where? There's no ice here. That's, no, that's ice. No boots. That's, that's nice. That's nice. Aww. <laughs> 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 Watch the people. I'm going to shoot right now. I got hat. <laughs> no! Hello. Go see the lions and our whole group of blogger kids. And Maria's already tired. <laughs> they want to be on. They want to be on YouTube. I'm on YouTube. Come on, get in YouTube. <laughs> We're gonna go see the lions. Antelope, and then the lions are down there. Yeah, I think we gotta. Uh -huh. Come on, I'm on. I'm on. Freaking lion. <laughs> we just took a picture. <laughs> yeah. I was, I was trying to catch a video clip, but they ran away before I could even catch it. <laughs> Say hi. Hi, hi Danielle. Say hi, Nicole. Taylor's like, I want to be on YouTube. <laughs> she knows everybody. <laughs> Hold, okay? You said you're a cat. Emmeline, Emmeline, stay straight. What, what's your bug? I don't know. What's your bug, Dylan? A grasshopper. Grasshopper?
que es mía? In the Bronx Zoo, we did not even go to nearly half of the things to see here, but everybody's tired, meltdowns, because we just came from the really? movie. Give me my umbrella! Why? Everybody's tired, now Colby's waking up because she's crying. But we'll have to come back another time. This is just too much to see. And nobody's in the mood right now. Cody for Colby. Add to our five below shopping cart. Priceless. <laughs> is it five below? Yeah. Five Priceless, loser. Give me one dollar. No. Oh. 